Well, firstly, probably looking at them, you want to see them nice and relaxed and not getting hot and I'm stressed about where they come from and where they are at the moment. So I think that's first, first and foremost, it's just a not quiet for me. Can you talk to Will about horses behind the gate in Tabra and staying here? What about a thousand meters here at Eagle Park? Do you mind if they get bumped up? We talk about sweating a lot, me being a yard watcher. I often chat about how they pray, but what about when they get round to the gate? It's probably one time where you wouldn't worry too much about it. These horses are they're fast, they're, they're quick switch and they, they're, their brains are going flat out and it's a warm atmosphere up in Queensland, you know, there's humidity to deal with and these horses are often very buzzed up. So it's it's one time where you can probably relax a little bit as a jockey if they are getting a bit of a dollar. Not too far away from a start line here is David Fowler. Blue Spinel runs for the rail, runs for the favourite. And they're racing now, jumping the good line, Blue Spinel on the first to go, playing the sprints with speed, and there goes Ken May. The gold goes there, flying in the front from playing the sprints. It gets across to the rail to be second, and Blue Spinel the favourite, fades in a handy third. Walker is the sister, then Caribbean King the billionaire, followed by Billy's Pro Hour Red Favour, and No Speed Master Morris last. Down by the 600 metres, Ken by she is making every person when he posed. Flying along by quarter, Clovis Print second. Blue Spinel popped away from the rail. The rest of sister going a little wider. Then Caribbean King, the billionaire, our red planet. Followed by Billy's Bro and Master Morris with the task ahead. In the straight though, now by the 300 metres, Cam by the leader, going strongly. From on the outside, Blue Spinel there running on gaily. Clovis Print was still there. Then Caribbean King, but Blue Spinel and Ange Jones, the favourite combination, raced up in the lead, moved away, and Blue Spinel is the first up winner. It's either Clovis Prince or Caribbean King from either the Billionaire or Master Morris and Barista Sister, and by Wicked Lake and Billy Crow and our red planet last name of the line. Blue Spinel, this mare by Hellbent, the day would be victorious. First up into the preparation that brings her record to 10 stars for four wins and two minor placings. Trained by the master Tony Gollum, ridden by Ange Jones. Kathy, do you have a, a lot to do with Ange Jones or being able to watch her riding from afar? I've watched the riding from afar. I've never actually met Ange, but um, she, she's another jockey that's really coming through the ranks and she's learned a craft. I've watched her from she, since she was an apprentice. And she's making all the right decisions and riding good races and strong in a finish leg. She's, um, she's really one to watch, I think. She certainly is. There it is, Blue Spinel, just getting the job done uh, over. I guess the final divvy in the end, but it was a, actually a very strong win in the end. That uh, Tony gets his horses pretty round up, but you can see that making good amounts of ground for back in the field. So we will bring you those final divvies in just one moment when we get them. But we're heading to Flemington next, and there's uh, another interesting runner in this race. So this is uh, Naval Seal, of course, he's out of Route 1 Flight 7.